we can fight like dogs, we can fight like cats. I do it like Hey guys, this is Yang Yang. In this video, I'm going to teach you how to hold your table tennis racket and the basic body position. There are two popular ways to hold your racket. One is called shake hand style, and another is called pen holder. So let's start it with the shake hand style. This one is much more popular than pen holder. You can tell by watching all the national levels game. Most players use this to play table tennis. And for beginner, I would like to recommend you to use this too, because it's easier to control and to balance your forehand and backhand. It looks like a handshake. So imagine you are going to shake hands with your racket. You like, hey racket, nice to meet you. And uh, don't care about your racket, would like to shake hands with you or not. Just do it. Put your handle between your thumb and point the finger. Make sure your thumb and the point the finger are at the bottom of each side. Then put your other fingers around the handle. Here's the most important thing about shake hand style. There are three points to keep your racket stable. Thumb, point the finger, middle finger. So when you hold your racket, you use those three points to stabilize your racket. Don't hold it too tight. Imagine he is your friend. Don't hug him too tight. He needs to breathe too, right? So keep your head loose. Make it more flexible. Okay, let's take a look at pen holder. First, we need to use a pen holder style racket, which has a shorter handle. Put your racket upward. Have your thumb and point finger across the handle. At the back, curl your rest of fingers. These are two main ways to hold your racket. Just try them out, you will know which way you like better. So first, let's get our legs a little wider than our shoulders. So this position is to keep your balance and a quick move. We don't want to open it too wide or too narrow. Cause if it is too wide, we cannot start fast. And if it is too narrow, we will easily lose our balance. Then, put your left leg a little ahead of your right leg. That's for the right hand player. If you are a left hand player, do the opposite way. Put your right leg ahead of your left leg. And the both of your feet should face forward. Second, bind your knees. Lay your body forward. For an advanced player, I would recommend you to put your weight on your toes so that you can move fast and more flexible. So try to practice this standing position at home by yourself. Third, bend your back, compact your body. First, put both of your hands in the middle of your body. It will help you balance. Fifth, relax your body. Relax. Then imagine you are like a spring. Your legs are ready to jump. That's it. The way we hold our racket and the basic body position Welcome to the world of table tennis. In my next video, I will teach you how to play your forehand. Thanks for watching. I will see you in my next video. Bye!